Josie here again from Life at 50 and Beyond. Thanks for joining me here again my channel for another haul. Today I have a short Dollar Tree haul and also a small uh, haul from Walmart. I haven't done any Walmart haul but I figured you know after a while that I have not been into Walmart. I think it has been a couple of months or more since I last went to Walmart. It's always been my husband and daughter who would sometimes go there on errands and uh, you know buy the dog food and etc. But yesterday I felt like going there because I wanted to buy some uh, big storage units for my daughter's uh, closet and I did buy one. It's a Sterilite uh, you know drawer or organizer that I can use for her clothes. However I wouldn't be including that on this haul uh, uh, because the fact that it's really huge but I'm just going to be inserting a photo of which here and the price it's actually $24.92 it's a five drawer uh, plastic you know organizer drawer unit and uh, it's $24.92 anyway uh, getting started with just the Walmart first and then I will move on to my Dollar Tree haul because again it's unique for me to do a Walmart haul I have here a 400 sheets Georgia Pacific Standard multi-purpose paper. I purchased this for $2.50 at Walmart. I don't know where else you can buy it cheaper, but I do like their paper and I use this for printing. And sometimes when I am trying to uh, double up on the journal, it's thin enough that if I don't want to show what's underneath, especially if it's a used journal that you may want to write on, it's a tip for you and you want to recycle it and you still see some pages there that are you know uh, blank and there are just a few that have been written on you can just cover it with some thin paper and then cover it with another decorative paper so that it doesn't show through so that's that so this is uh, again 400 sheets there's one there that's 750 sheets that's five dollars something but I figure this is cheaper because uh, this is for two dollars fifty cents if I buy two of this is 800 sheets so it's 40 or 50 sheets more for um, for less than double the price so moving on to the other items here um, I only purchased one set of card stocks there's 30 sheets here simply because I already hold quite a few um, scrapbooking and uh, paper and decorative pads especially when Michaels had their five dollar uh, paper pad sale I think they also have a special this week uh, at Michaels and I haven't been down there yet because I know that I am going to be buying more I'm trying to really cut down on expenses and plus I still have a lot more paper that I still need to use I don't want to go into a I gotta have it thing when you know I'm trying to also uh, work on our budget but I like this gingham colors a 12 by 12 cardstock and I only got this for five dollars at Walmart they do have decorative pads there or sheets that you can use for scrapbooking and they come in 50 sheets and I will insert the photos here and they are five dollars regular price daily so you don't have to go to Michaels and wait for their sale or use their coupons. They really do have those uh, decorative pads or paper there. They may not be a card stock. However, again, they're good for doubling up. They're good for, you know, if you're creating your own traveler's journal and you want the pages to be decorated, but you don't want them too thick because they will thicken up your your wallet or wherever you're doing your organization or your planners then that's the place to go to so that's a pretty good deal for 50 sheets but again I only bought this because I'm decorating currently my happy planner my huge uh, happy planner and I want to be able to incorporate this on the decorations as well as my scrapbook booking and other paper projects so I think that's a pretty good deal and then I have a bunch of stickers and let me just show you one by one what they are let me just start off with this value 18 pack sheets 684 pieces in it it's an everyday stickers and I think uh, this is a product by EK success 
and these are stickos and what I like about this one is they're small enough to fit into any of my planners so if I'm decorating my planners uh, they will look great this is about $2.84 um, I think for the price and for the um, for I think for the amount of stickers I think that value is excellent so yeah let me just uh, give you a preview on this one here let me rip this up so uh, there are a couple of styles that I found there one has cupcakes and some sweets however I found that this design suits me better I'm more attracted on the animal prints and the colors here. So this one here, and I think they're repeated several times. Not sure how many, maybe three times. And there's a woodland theme here. Yeah, I think they're repeated three times on each, on each page. is repeated three times, which is great. And look at this. These are small enough for you to again use on your planners right all of them actually even the ones that I showed uh, to begin with and these are the animals again uh, showing here and their uh, faces or part of their faces that are or their heads that are on hearts and look at the letters here alphas wonderful so you can actually mix and match this with your other stickers that you may have. I know of some that I purchased from Dollar Tree a while back. And um, even my Happy Planner stickers that are in the same color theme that I can mix and match with. Again, 18 pack sheets, 684 pieces for $2.84. Let's go to all my stickers that I hold. I find them cheaper again there I think the price is right for this one 97 cents each and here are they I'm going to be showing them to you one by one uh, let's start off with the ladybugs this is where these are what you call theme stickers and there are about 44 pieces here and they are a little bit of pop-up they're not flat okay certainly not flat so that's one and how good would that work with my red gingham and I have the hearts here in different colors different a uh, couple of sizes the teeny ones and the small one uh, 220 pieces for 97 cents I bought uh, two of each design here the other ones I just bought one piece reason why and I'll show you the reason why is because I plan to do another giveaway and I'm starting to, to accumulate the items that I'm going to include in the giveaway and I found that these ladybugs and these hearts are really going to be uh, very attractive so I'm putting them aside here the ones that I'm going to give on a giveaway so those are 97 cents each so I like this one the beach theme this really speaks of summer I'm so excited to update my uh, planner with this Another one is this heart theme. So not great the colors and the design. So this one come in 13 pieces. This one in 19 pieces. So all of these stickers that I'm showing you are all 97 cents. There are some there that are a dollar 97 each, and I think it depends on how they're designed and you know how um, probably the mo the more 3D they are, the more expensive they are. Love this one. Can't wait to decorate the travel theme that I have in mind for when we went to the Philippines and I'm going to be using this unfortunately only one was left in this style I would have wanted to buy two uh, or three one for the giveaway and one for my another extra one for myself so that's 27 pieces for 97 cents this one a family theme for an owl theme and this one has 15 pieces for 97 cents again this one also family but more on the lovebirds I love the theme and I like that there are writings here we grow in different directions yet our roofs remain as one so that's also 97 cents for 16 pieces another here oh my gosh this is so kawaii so cute 
15 pieces panda theme and here's one for the monkey theme monkey lovers 16 pieces as well love the banana love his cute smile okay another one for the ladybug lovers this one comes with flowers and leaves and this is 28 pieces all in all for 97 cents and this one love love this one as well 16 pieces and uh, you know the floral and the, the swirl and you know this is wonderful really love that moving on to the other themed ones here from the narrower pack 53 pieces sports team uh, different kinds of uh, balls baseball soccer football and uh, volleyball I think is here and tennis isn't that great 53 pieces hearts oh my gosh more hearts love that there's this one polka dotted here and there again um, a pop-up oh this one love this one that's 113 pieces by the way and this one is 31 pieces I should get another one because I'm going to be using this right away for this month and I want to stock up who knows they may go on clearance too someday I'll wait for that I'll be on the lookout for that but look at this cute strawberry and ice cream cupcakes here's another one look at all these assorted fishies 22 pieces and woodland theme here well with well animal theme because uh we have a whale here as well cute turtle everything is cute here guys it's 37 pieces 97 cents the owl theme with some flowers also again yeah, these are puppy puffy puffy stick <laughs> pop-up stickers wow 10 pieces for 97 cents and wow 35 pieces here again perfect size for your planner whether it's a mini planner or you know the a5 or the big or huge one so that's for the walmart one and let me go to the dollar tree let me just set them aside so I went to our Dollar Tree and here's my haul. It's just going to be small compared to my previous hauls. It's because I just went there to do a little bit of errand when it comes to, you know, cleaning materials for our home. I did buy some stickers because I never leave the doll go and leave the Dollar Tree without buying me some stickers or something from, you know, the uh, something that has to do with paper crafting or paper product. So let's go and maybe I'll I'll start off with the stickers since uh, I already mentioned I went there with stickers in hand and this is nice because this is the reward 413 stickers there are five sheets and this is in the school supply section there are five sheets here and let me just show you briefly um, these are actually more kudos to the kids this is in the kids school supply section I think it's also a section for elementary or middle school teachers and these are the stickers that not only teachers or students can use but also you as a parent if you have young kids and you want to give them kudos and also for me what I'm going to be doing here is just to put it on my planner so here's what you have here these words and kudos you can actually use on your planner depending on the theme just just work with it and uh, you will see as I do my planner walk through and flip through as well as plan with me I'm using some of the stickers that I got from uh, you know the school supply section because I think they're just the right size look at this love love the design again there are 413 stickers here another one here that I haven't hold yet again I'm trying to I'm starting to collect more items for for boys well there 
there are some girls who love to ride the motorcycles too so just in case you know anyone who's just into motorcycles then this will be perfect doesn't have to be a boy or a girl and there are 15 stickers here moving on to some of the flat stickers so that's a puff puffy sticker so love this one I haven't had this style yet so I only took one there are 12 count here this is more like a foil silver foil design with purple and blue and then some gems and love the dragonfly and butterfly design along with the flowers here's another butterfly design no dragonfly this time but there are 12 count here and like this one it's glittery on the wings and there's a couple of gems here and there and then some flowers as well okay. and uh, kind of like the butterfly here there are also dragonflies in this pink and yellow color glittered as well 12 counts so love this design and the owls only one left for the owls they are just so adorable no wonder they go first they get sold out first so there are 12 of them here in assorted size but the color is purple and green so I love this design as well who can resist the cuteness of owls right eight pieces of blank note cards love that the you know the dog it's riding this bicycle with a gift so again I love to collect note cards and I like to use them as well not only for thanking people but also incorporating them on my paper projects and this one only one left this is in the school supply section so there are a dozen of this binder clips and they're colorful there's orange there's there's yellow, there's blue, purple, pink, and green. So almost the color of the rainbow. And there's a sorted size here. You know what is here. Let me see if I could yeah, pull this down here. Some are smaller than the rest. So they come in three sizes, the large, the medium, and the small. So isn't that great for a dollar? There are 12 pieces there from the floral section. So there are several twines there that they were selling, but I only purchased this green one, this twine. It's three yards for a dollar. And I will be showing some photos again at the end of this uh, video, uh, you know, some photos uh, that I took of those items that I didn't buy and then some items that you may be interested in. And uh, I bought this item here as well. In the electronics section everybody's raving about this but I finally found the one that fits my phone an iPhone 6 or 6s and see tempered glass uh, screen guard can be very expensive it ranges from five dollars and up depending on where you'll buy them if you get them from the service provider stores they're even much higher but at Amazon you can find them between five dollars and fifteen dollars but here at Dollar Tree of course you can only find I don't know yet how it's gonna work out but I do love that it has a nice case and I can use this also I never throw away anything especially if I can repurpose it There's some beauty items here I have had one in orange case before and I took it to the Philippines and I gave it to my sister I thought I was going to use it for myself there somehow in case I have like an emergency um, you know nail cutter and cuticle breakup but then uh, you know since it was still sealed I left it with her and she loves it she likes working on her nails some, some of the times if she doesn't go to the parlor and I also got this petroleum jelly baby love 100% pure paraben free and it's for my daughter Jessica and I we love using uh, petroleum jelly so I figured we'll use that you know summertime you get itches and rashes everywhere especially when we were in the Philippines she 
she had some rashes so we brought some uh, petroleum jelly there and she was able to use them as well and they just subsided after a while oh sorry I forgot to mention this on the school supplies as well these are the washable glue pens I haven't seen this before from our Dollar Tree and this was actually placed near the cashier so you know those items the grab items that will grab you and while you're waiting in line and this is the precision tip that's why I like it because sometimes I glue on small items and especially those beads or really narrow or small small teeny weeny items and this is perfect because it won't blob off on the sides so it's perfect again for your crafting needs and I think I have a couple more for the beauty section I have this BB beauty cream I think there was one that I hold before in light color and I left it again with my sister because I had brought it to the Philippines in case I ran out of my foundation and I can use this somehow and I haven't tried it and it was still sealed I left it with her you know I left most of my items with her the items that I did not use and this one Vaseline it moisturizes to protect chapped dry lips and this one I haven't tried before but I've when I've seen this I figured oh I'm gonna keep give it a try it's by skin nutrition's New York it's an age defy ultimate dark spot corrector and I think I mentioned on my last or my my last Dollar Tree haul that uh, I have melasma and their dark spots so hopefully this will help and you know 50, life at 50 and beyond you get wrinkles you get dark spots so try everything that you can do to kind of correct them and that's what I'm trying to do as well in an economical way so that's where those are the beauty items and I have some for the home and I've seen this and I like the scent this is my favorite there are different scents there and again I'm going to be sharing the photos at the end raspberry framboise renesit I hope I pronounce it right but I think I'm going to give this a shot I'm going to put this on uh, uh, inside our powder room or guest bathroom downstairs and I have tested this out I'm actually testing this too out in our toilet and this one I took to there by the home store toilet bowl cleaner bleach in every flush so I got one it comes in two tabs each four dollar there's one that is that has also the blue color in it when you flush so I've got the one that's plain or colorless and I have the one that's blue when you flush so I've already it's empty now this two and I'm using it on the two bathrooms upstairs and this one I'm gonna try to use downstairs next okay and I also got this two in one quick eraser scrub buddies I love this and you know they remove the gunk and then it wipes and erase you can wet it and it's reusable so I'm gonna give that a shot too and I'm gonna be hopefully being able to review some of the items here and we live in an area where the water has a lot of calcium I think and I've called the water district they said they tested it they provided us with a report and that it's good blah 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 but then it doesn't seem to be I mean I think our water is really hard that's all I can say that's why our some of our neighbors are putting that water softener but that costs like an arm and a leg and so I'd rather not so here's the thing that I hope that will help you know when we're cleaning our toilet bowl our sinks our showers you know the shower heads as well as the faucets so hopefully this will help and again I'm going to be providing a review uh, this is the Ross lime calcium We've tried CLR, but hasn't really worked well. So hopefully something um, like this would work. And I'm wondering if they have this same content or something different. But I'm going to provide a review just in case. And finally, an item that I have been trying to search far and wide. Finally found one, and this is the only remaining one. And the cashier had to go back and help me. Because when I described it to her, she understood exactly what I was saying. And she said that she got one herself. And she pointed us towards it. And my daughter went back. She couldn't find it. No wonder. They ran out of them. However, 
on the platform on the floor at the very bottom something fell and that last piece is now mine this is the drain router I don't know I think some of you have hold this but I have been looking for this for for I think months now from different stores and they're always sold out and this is the one where you can pull the hair and clogs easily because no matter what you use those uh, uh, plumbing liquids sometimes they will ruin your plumbing uh, structures this is Josie from life at 50 and beyond thanks for joining me here in my channel click like subscribe comment down below talk to you later bye